Hey guys, what's going on? This is GP here. Welcome to a game that's a little different that I just recently got and I'm super excited to play. And yeah, I'm really excited basically. Um, welcome to Don't Starve, or should I say, um, Don't Starve Pocket Edition. So, this is a little cutscene. I've never seen this before. But I do know about the game. And it seems pretty popular even to this year. I'm really excited to play this. So yeah, very Tim Burton-esque feel, you could say. Uh, basically, if you guys haven't heard of Don't Starve, it's very similar. Okay, I think we can skip that. I'll check out the full thing later. It's very similar to Minecraft, in a way, but in its own style. So, I haven't played this before, I've seen people play it, so we're just gonna jump in. Cancel or morgue. What is morgue? Obituaries, days live, cause of death. Okay, so... Very interesting. So we're gonna go for a new game. Uh... I think I'm gonna go for... The classic. Obviously. So, obviously you can change your characters. You can be different people, so I can't play as these people just yet, but still. So it looks like I'm going to have to start with the classic character. The scientist. So let's apply that, obviously, and let's start Reign of Giants Enabled. An expansion geared towards experienced Stone Star players. Playing with the expansion enabled adds two more seasons, more items, and enemies. And it's more challenging. Uh, so it's enabled. So hopefully, don't press the. Hopefully, I press the right button because I might just die easily if that's the case. Generating world. This will be an interesting experience indeed, because I've never played it before. All right. Of course, it's called Don't Starve. So. Yeah, very simplistic. So you tap on stuff to pick it up. I know that much. And they talk. So you have a hunger meter, a health meter, and a sanity meter. If you're in range. So, and the days are pretty unique as well. I just killed a butterfly. I feel very terrible now. Okay, so I missed that. I feel terrible. I did not expect to kill a butterfly. Okay. Berry bush. There's some food. Right off the bat. So it is very similar to Minecraft. So you, so you can see inventory. Here's our local map. Our local location. Carrots. I've actually been waiting to get this game to play because I've actually been very excited about it. I believe that's some rocks up there. Some stone or something. Flint! Ah, yes. I remember now. Okay. And there's a multiplayer mode too called Don't Starve Together. Don't know if that's Pocket Edition as well, but if it is, I might play this with some friends if they can get it. That wouldn't be too bad of an idea. Alright, I'm probably gonna die horribly. And actually, tell you what, it's actually pretty late where I am right now. So I think... I'll... I'll basically be where I was before, when I left off. And the day is getting pretty... Slow. So let's see what I can do. An axe. Okay. So I've crafted an axe at least. I'll take out a few trees. Then I'll take a break and then... Okay, I need to hold it down. Then by the time you see me again, I'll um... Hopefully be doing better. Yeah. So let's take down this big tree. Gotta be careful of this though because they can turn into monsters that are really tough to beat. 
and pine cones so I can replant them. And let's take down one more. And I'll take a bit of a break and see you guys again. Basically, really soon because it comes right after. Don't know what I'm doing. Okay, carrots. Might as well grab. Okay. So, see you soon then. Okay, so I'm back and it turns out it started me all over again. So, different area. Gotta recollect everything. That's fine. No big deal. But I saw the full cutscene this time. It really is. It's got an interesting story, it would seem. Don't know who this guy is manipulating everything, but. It's got an interesting looking plot. Oh, there's some food. Actually, I don't know about this game because I know that you kill bunnies as a main source of food. I don't know if I can do that, so. I might thrive on other things. Yeah, it's a pine tree, that's why. Hopefully you guys can hear me well. Okay. What was that? Okay, I don't know what that was. Um, got flint. I need... To make an axe again. Might as well keep grabbing these saplings and grass, though. Okay, so I can make some things. I'll make the axe again. Obviously, I need that. And uh, that's some rather lovely music. I didn't hear that last time. Okay, talking about the tree just filled. Wait a second, what? Okay, so the day is shorter than the last time I noticed that. Maybe I have the thing with the giants, reign of giants on, I don't know. All I know is I need to hurry up because it's going to be a pretty short time before it reaches night. And I need to get the basics down. Okay, know that you don't really build a house like you do in Minecraft. You have to set up a camp or something like that. That's the uniquity with this. Yep, and it's starting to get a bit darker. Of course, in this terrain setting, it's gonna get real dark. If I can find Don't Star together, it will be fun, because I'd love to do this with friends. I know a few friends actually do enjoy this game. Or didn't even know about this, so if they can get it, that would be a treat. Let's grab the sapling real quick. And let's see, what can I do? Make a torch and a campfire. That's what I'll need. I can make a trap. Pretty parasol. Protection. Interesting. Okay. And here's the more advanced stuff. We've got science machines. New crafting recipes, basically. Grass suit. Protection. Hats. Okay. So I'll build a torch to use, and I got some wood, so I'll build a campfire. D you saw me right. Oh, wait. I don't have enough grass. Okay. Gotta find some grass, then. Oh, that shouldn't be too big of a deal. I hope. Okay, didn't find grass, but I found these. Oh, that's a beehive! Okay! I don't want to do that. I haven't found any grass yet either. Oh, no. This looks like a graveyard. Ooh, there's gold. Okay. That's a good find. I got rocks. Um, there's some grass. Okay. Let me make a campfire soon. I've still got plenty of time left, though, fortunately. The evenings are pretty long. And the night's actually pretty short. Looks like I'm gonna need a pickaxe. But I need more flint. Well, well, there we go. That's what I was looking for. Okay. So I can break the rocks. 
equip. Perfect. I can go for this. Lovely, I got more flint and the gold nuggets. So those have the gold veins in them. I remember that from watching the game. The rocks with the lines running down them have the gold in them. What was that? I saw something move there. Oh no, it's raining. This can't be good. Okay. It tells you all of your basic diagrams. Right. So I think I'll set up camp here then. This looks like a nice spot. Don't know how well that'll do with the rain though. Might wanna equip my axe and build that campfire real quick. Here. Okay. Yes, thank you, tree. That's really nice. I need to take care of my campfire before it goes out. I believe I do that by, um, where's the logs? The logs. Here we go. Add fuel. There we go. And let's add one more. Okay, looks like we're good. It's definitely different because I kind of have to tap the bar to get stuff, but it's not bad. Oh, I got nitre. Nitter, nitter, I don't know how to say that. Okay. They grab this flint. Then run in. Because things will attack you from the darkness and it's not pleasant. I'll tell that. I'll say that that much. Okay. Here's also where I can cook stuff on the fire. And now, as the game entails, don't starve. Uh, I believe I can do that with... Seeds as well. Yeah, I got toasted seeds. Oh, that's great. Awesomeness. Uh, anything else that I can do? I'll cook another carrot, because why not? And berries, real quick. Just one. Roasted berries. It looks like jam. It's always nice, though. And my health goes up. As you can see, there's the hunger bar. The health, and then this is sanity. You can actually go insane in this game, if you didn't know. For those of you who don't really know, don't starve. And when you do that, there's a monster that follows you, and it can actually attack you if you're fully insane. And you don't want that. And your sanity lowers by doing stuff like digging graves, which you saw back there. So I'm gonna stay close to the fire, kind of feed fuel. Make it last a little bit longer. Because, crazy enough, I've actually almost made through the, th the first night. Actually, what's this? I can make a science machine. Already. Awesome, I'll place it over here then. Yup. Well, it'll be a little farther. That's nice, so I made a science machine. Oh yeah, now I can make a lot of stuff. Lovely. Oh yeah. Looks like I got a lot of new stuff added now. That's great. Okay, so it turns out that I'm actually getting wet. That's what that water meter was. So I'll build a parasol to keep myself dry. And there we go, first day done. Awesome. Saving my progress. Incredible work. Let me grab some flint. There we go. I saw these. Uh, supposedly they're glaciers. I've never seen them before. Well, when other people played. So I'm going to quit my pickaxe. I'm going to try to break it. See what happens here. Because I've never seen them before. Mini glacier. Looks like... Oh, I got ice. Nice, I'll bet you I'll be able to use something good for ice. And already looks like my uh, inventory is starting to stock up. 
I'll get this uh, gold vein. And now let me re-equip my parasol. It's not a pretty parasol though, which I'm kind of not keen of. Lovely music though, I didn't know. Oh. Okay, can't turn any more stuff. Frog legs and fish? That's new. Okay. Play well, just eat these berries then. I'm just kind of getting a little bit low. So it's like I can collect fish and frog legs? When they add that? I can tell you this much, that's new. Oh, crud. Well, pickaxe is broke. And I can't carry any more stuff. Isn't that wonderful? Alright, I can build a fire pit now, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that. And I know it's nowhere close to dark yet. But, you know, I think I'm gonna call the episode here. Because I made it my first night. It's actually reached that time again. And yeah, I knew I could cook the fish. That's really interesting. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this. I'm gonna have a piece of fish real quick. If you did, I've been really excited for this game to play it. If you enjoyed it, leave a like, subscribe to Jace Alliance. Um, and yeah, can't think of really much else to say. Share this video with your friends if they like this stuff. Shalmany player, oh. <laughs> and I will see you guys in the next video. Stay gold, my friends, and bye bye